overclockers, are you looking for a unique way to showcase your PC hardware? Maybe those straggly RGB light strips just aren't cutting it. Well, let me introduce you to our new TechForge Lightbox range, created in-house at Overclockers UK. Keep watching to learn more and see how easy they are to install in this step-by-step -step tutorial. There are a range of different light boxes available, especially designed and created in-house at Overclockers UK by the TechForge team. There is a wide selection of compatible PC cases that is constantly being expanded and it includes popular designs from brands such as Fantex, Lianli, Corsair, APNX and Asus. Depending on the case, there will also be options in black and white, which will match your other components and create a clean look that blends into your PSU shroud or the bottom of your case. Pricing does vary depending on the size and the shape of your case, and you can see the full range of light boxes by heading to the Personalize Your Play section of the Overclockers UK website. They're also available in some of our built-to-order PC systems. The RGB lighting is controlled using a 3-pin or 5-volt RGB connector, which can be plugged into a compatible header on your motherboard or RGB hub. This means you can control the color, the effects, and the brightness using your existing PC hardware and RGB software. The TechForge Lightbox will work just like an RGB strip or RGB fans and integrate into your system perfectly. Step one is to grab a screwdriver and cable ties and prepare your PC case for installation. Make sure your PC is turned off and disconnected, then carefully remove the side panels following the instructions for your specific case. There might be screws, hence the screwdriver, or even a button holding them in place. Step two is to carefully remove your light box from the packaging. It comes tightly packaged in expandable foam and you will also find a quick start leaflet with some simple written instructions. Step three is to prepare your case for installation. Decide where you want to install the light box. We recommend the bottom of the case as this is where your light box has been designed and cut to fit neatly. Be sure that the light box is not going to interfere with any of your other PC components or the airflow within your case when you're installing. Prepare the PSU shroud or surface of the case floor by wiping away dust and ensuring the area is clean and dry. This allows for the included double-sided tape or sticky pads to stay in place. Step four is installation. For secure mounting, use the provided double-sided tape or sticky pads. Peel off the protective backing and press firmly into your mounting location. Step five is to connect the light box directly to your motherboard or a compatible RGB controller. For motherboards, securely connect the DRGB cable directly to the motherboard's three pin or five volt DRGB header. For RGB controllers, use the provided cable to connect the light box to the controller. Double check to make sure the connections are nice and secure. Step six is to power on your PC and check to see if the lighting is working. If you plugged your light box into an RGB controller, you can use the button on your case, the remote control, or the button on the controller. Some controllers might also have their own software. If you opted to plug it into your motherboard header, you will need to use the software that has been created by your motherboard manufacturer. This can be found on their website. There are software such as Asus Aura Core, MSI Mystic Lite, Gigabyte RGB Fusion, NZXT Cam, ASRock RGB Sync, etc, etc. Step seven is maintenance. When you're undertaking your general PC cleaning and dust removal, make sure to give your light box a quick wipe over with a dry microfiber cloth. Make sure you don't use any harsh chemicals as this could damage the acrylic. That's it. If you encounter any issues while installing your light box, make sure to refer to the manual or contact our friendly customer support team who will be happy to answer any questions. 
If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, subscribe, and if you want to see more, why not check out more of the Tech Forge range and find out how you can personalize your very own gaming chair by watching the video below. I'll see you again in the next one.